Hi everyone, Colour with Claire here. I was asked on a previous video that I did yesterday of my colouring station if I could do a video of my Faber-Castell Polychromos pencils. Um, so here they are. This is the tin that they come in. This is the biggest set that they do, 120. And it's a beautiful quality metal tin. It opens up, I'll just move these, to reveal three layers of pencils. So you have your top layer, which is your whites, yellows, down into your reds, pinks and purples. And then into your indigo blues, right up to sky blues, through to greens and into browns. And then the bottom layer is your skin tones, um, and some sort of different brown shades, your greys into your blacks, and there's three metallics as well. And that's just everything what you get. So as you can see, they provide these elastic handles for you to lift out trays really easily. So it's a great quality thing. These are just plastic, but each one has its own little nook for the pencil, so they're not going to go anywhere. So that's it really, there's not much more I can tell you without going into the whole pencil details, which I've already done on my Polychromos versus Prismacolor blog post. I'll put the link for that in the description below. But Polychromos really are, in my opinion, the best quality pencil crayons on the market. Um, now I'm not an artist and lots of people have lots of different opinions. I know that there are Prismacolor diehard fans, there are Karen Dash fans, um, but you know what, it's each to their own, but I just find that these are brilliant to work with. They blend like a dream. There's no sort of oil marks or wax bloom like you might find um, in a Prismacolors. Uh, the pencils themselves are actually quite durable and strong. They've got a really robust round barrel and I mean I'll just compare them here. We get a Prismacolor. So here is a Prismacolor next to a Polychromo. So you can probably see just how how much more stronger it looks. I mean the, the lead here is a lot thicker um, the point it gets to a point and it's quite dense you know so you're not just going to snap it every on every stroke prismacolors are quite crumbly these are totally opposite so the paper that i took out at the start is my color charts that i printed off from the net and i've got every single color here charted out so I can see how they're going to turn out so I can pick palettes if I've got a certain shade of a colour in mind and I just don't know what it's called and can't think I can just refer to this um, colour chart and I'll know exactly where to go straight away so yeah um, I think that's all I can tell you about these pencils <clears throat> like I say read my uh, Prismacolor versus Polychromos um, comparison blog post and yeah, so this is the Faber-Castell 120 set. They're around about £130 on Amazon. Well worth it though. They are expensive, but they will last you a long time and they will produce the best results. So yeah, hope you've enjoyed this video and I'll see you soon on Colour with Claire.